Our spirit box session today once again is all about summer wells. This should be an interesting session. I have a lot of questions for Miss Summer. That's the only person uh, that we're asking for today is Summer or her spirit guides. Of course, God and Jesus and the archangels and all the high, kind, loving, light, high vibrational spirits of God are welcome to come in and help us out with today's session. I'm going to be using a brand new app, guys. This app is free. This is called the Hope Spirit Box. This is free for Android and iOS. This is an app created by Josh Lewis from Hope Paranormal. If you haven't checked out his channel, please do so. He does not get into a lot of true crime, but he does get amazing and loving messages for family. In fact, he's going to be live in St. Augustine, Florida in August. I'll show you the dates here. But that's what we're going to use today. The HSB1. It does have instructions when you open it. If you watch the little instructional video on how to do it. I do have it already set up. And I have a list of questions and we're going to get right into it. Alright, Miss Summer, it's me, Judy. I've been watching the interview room with Chris McDonough. Mr. Chris met your mama out at the swimming hole that day. Did you see your mama and Chris at the swimming hole when they were there just the other day? The voice is going to be a little bit different, guys. It's still a child's voice, but it's not going to sound the same as the other app I was using. Miss Summer. Yes. Can you tell us if your grandma was at the swimming hole with you? Did your grandma come with you guys that day to go swimming? Do you remember? Did you have fun swimming that day, Miss Summer, at the swimming hole, at the horse pond? Yes. How about after swimming, Miss Summer? After you were done swimming, was everything okay? Were you okay when you were done swimming? Something about a puppy? Wow, I got that in my other sessions. Um, can I ask you, if you went to Sonic, did you get to get a slushy from Sonic after you went swimming? Or was that before? Do you know? Okay. Wow. Um, what kind of slushy did you get, Miss Summer? What color? What color slushy did you get? Okay. Sounded like I just want to stay outside. I just I need to listen to that again. Baby girl, Summer, did you wait in the truck when your mama and your grandma went to get milk and groceries? Were you just kicking back in the truck watching TikTok? Is that true? All right, and another 
other session I recorded that it was stupid hot that day. Was it hot when you guys went to the grocery store? Were you tired after you went swimming, honey? Did you fall asleep? Forgot shoes. Baby, when you took H home, did you get to see Miss Allison? After you went swimming, did you get to see Allison and give her a big hug? Um, so did you fall asleep in the truck, Miss Summer? It's the second time I feel like I've heard sandwich and we've never heard anything about them stopping to get any kind of food anywhere, just candy and slushies and whatnot. Miss Summer, can you tell me what happened when you got home? Did you go back to your home that day after you went swimming? Did you go home and play in your room? Where is your bedroom at your house, Miss Summer? Can you tell me where your bedroom is? I saw your room on the interview room with Chris Madonna. I saw your mama and I saw all the toys in your room. You had a lot of nice toys, huh? Little things that you liked. Summer, I saw in that video on the interview room what looks like a camera hanging on the wall with wires in your bedroom. Was that a camera? Can you tell me? Did you plant flowers before? Uh, in another session I asked if you planted flowers with your mama and grandma and it said no, you couldn't. Can you confirm that if you planted flowers or not? There are a lot of puppies and kitties at your house. Do you like animals, Miss Summer? Your puppies and kitties? Your mama said you were just gone from the basement, that you were just gone. Is that true? What happened, honey? All right, baby. I heard you ask about the boys, your brothers, in a previous session. Can you see your brothers right now? Can you see where they went? Do you have any messages for them? There's no one at home. I'll have to listen to that again. Do you have any messages for Miss Robin from the church? 
She loves you so much, and I know she was your friend. Do you have any messages for Miss Robin? Do you have any messages for your mama or your daddy, Summer? Do you have any messages for your mama and your daddy? I love you so much, Miss Summer. Everybody loves you. We're all looking for you. We just we just love you, Miss Summer. Okay, and we can't forget about Juanita Louise. If you haven't checked out her Facebook, it's Juanita Louise Zifransky. I believe that's how I'm pronouncing it. She also has a YouTube channel, which I will link to in the description below. Don't give up on her. Here's a comment that somebody left under one of her posts about a loved one that Juanita found for them. So this is Judy Sheely, and it looks like she's responding to someone. She says, She brought one of my family friends home when he fell in dangerous waters and drowned. We couldn't find him for weeks. She pinned where he was, and he was able to be recovered. I'm sure she's not allowed to say things due to this being an active investigation. She does not want to ruin the chances of earthly justice for summer. I promise you I was a skeptic until she brought home someone close to me. I just wanted to take a moment and thank everyone who has shown me love on this channel. We just passed 10,000 subscribers on YouTube. I sure appreciate you. I just surpassed 30,000 followers on TikTok. I couldn't do this without you guys. I've gone to a part-time job from working 55 hours a week to do more YouTube, and I really appreciate you. I just wanted to say that. Take care, everybody. See you soon.